commitment to equality of outcome will not make the world a better place. Mm, no, I don't think it would. I think that um, this would lead to people being pressured into doing things they didn't want to do. It would um, undermine the whole idea of meritocracy. And meritocracy is a very valuable thing as long as you understand it as a method which works providing equality of opportunity is out there. Sometimes people think that when you say, I support meritocracy, you mean you think we already have one. I don't think we already have one. I think some people have much better um, f opportunities in life than, than other people. But this is a, an ideal. So we do want the best people for whatever job, and that isn't going to break down um, neatly to 50% men, 50% women, and so many people of colour or whatever that's representing the um, the, pop, the demographics of the population. We need to focus on any problems in equality of opportunity and let the outcomes fall where they will. Yeah. In like a liberal society, if we had full equal opportunity, there would be just difference in outcome. Yet new people coming into you know, the world growing up with the existence of disparate outcomes already there in society, how can we have equal opportunity and with with that there? Like wouldn't we need equality of outcome to have equal opportunity or what do you think of that? I I tend to think not. I understand that argument. It would just be for a short while we'd have um, more, we'd equalise up the groups so that um, it got the ball rolling. But I would still be quite worried about that. I still think we do better to address the problem at an earlier stage. So I sometimes use the example of my husband and me. Now, I went to a private school. I had a big quiet house with parents who both very much enjoyed learning. I had a fund for university. I really did have every opportunity. My husband had to leave school at 14 in order to help support his family and his school was terrible and he left it without any qualifications. So he did not have that same opportunity. It would not work for him to have then been given access to um, a university or a job that required a degree because he wouldn't have got there. The help needed to come earlier. It needed to, you know, there needed to be a better school for him. His school was was closed down on the year after he left because it was so bad. So we need to get get the problems earlier so that people actually then can take advantage of opportunities because one of the worries of trying to even things up is that it then puts people who haven't had the necessary background in order to be able to thrive in a situation in that situation and then blaming them if they don't manage to cope with it gotcha it's more like raising the floor of opportunity rather than like even people who maybe were at the top go back to the middle or the bottom or something like that yeah yes exactly okay. <laughs>